Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be a get ready with me type thing using um, entirely Malaysian drugstore products. So yeah, it's just basically me getting ready using Malaysian drugstore products. So if that sounds like something you guys would be interested in, then please keep watching. So I've actually already gone ahead and put my foundation and primer on just because I'm not ready to be completely there on camera just yet. So for primer, I use the Maybelline Baby Skin Pore Eraser and for foundation, I use the L'Oreal True Match. I'm in the shade D7 Golden Amber for the True Match. Next up is concealer and for that I'm using the Maybelline Pure Concealer Mineral Healthy Natural Concealer. This is actually one of my favorite drugstore concealers in Malaysia. Like, I honestly love this stuff. It is lighter than my skin tone, but I do want to kind of brighten this area here. I would normally use like a corrector first and then like a regular skin color concealer, but I don't have any of that in drugstore products, so I thought I'd just go in with the, uh, like the lighter concealer straight away and see how that goes. I'll just use that to kind of highlight as well and conceal. And to blend that out, I'm using my beauty blender. The way the beauty blender kind of um, picks up any excess concealer, because I tend to go like a little bit crazy on concealer, so using this really picks up any excess and really distributes it like a lot better. Eye roll on instant fairness BB eye roll on. Yeah, I don't know if this has a shade or anything, but yeah, basically it's the roll on eye thing, and I, it is very light, very fair for me, so I use it just to highlight a bit extra. And again, just going in with my beauty blender. dark circle one? I don't know. I know they have an anti dark circle one as well. Yeah, this isn't it. <laughs> yeah, I really like this because it isn't too much coverage, so I don't obviously use it as a concealer. I kind of just put it on top of concealer for like a little bit extra brightness. So I'm going to use this Into It Gel Tint. This one here. It is a lip and cheek tint. So yeah, since I don't have any drugstore blush, I'm just going to use this as a tint. And this one is in the shade Melon. I do really like these. I have a few of them and I love them. So for that, I'm just going to use a synthetic brush and kind of dab it in. concealer in place, I'm going to use the Maybelline Clara Smooth Extra Shine, Fear, Shine Free Powder Foundation. This one is in the shade Natural, so it is quite light for me, so I'm going to use it to set that highlight that I did. So I'm just pressing that on. I'm just going to bring some up onto my eyelid as well. So, yeah, I have to, have to, have to set it. All right, 
Alright, so next up, this is me cheating a little bit because I don't have any drugstore bronzer and I am obsessed with my NYX matte bronzer so I honestly could not live without this so I am allowed to do this. I'm going to go in and bronze out my face with the NYX bronzer. This is honestly like my favourite product that I own. I just, I don't know what it is. I love everything about this. I love the colour, I love the finish, I love, ugh, I use it for everything. Like I'll use it for contour. I'll use it for bronzer, I'll use it for eyeshadow. I honestly could not live without this. Okay, so next up is eyebrows, and for that I'm going to use the Silky Girl Eyebrow Pencil. It is the Natural Brow Pencil. This one is in 02 Dark Brown. So it's just like a regular pencil thing like this. I'm just going to comb through my brows first with a spoolie. I kind of do wish that it had the spoolie on the other end like some other um, brow pencils do, but oh well. So that's brows done. I actually really, really like this pencil. I don't know why I stopped using it, but yeah, the color and everything is actually really nice. So, I might go back to that. Okay, so next up is eyes. And for that, I'm going to use a little bit of tape just to create a crisp line because I am planning to do a pretty intense wing. So, I'm going to go ahead and take some tape and just line it up. I'm going to go in with my Maybelline color tattoo in the shade Bet Bronze. I feel like I have to use this in every look, like no matter what I'm doing, so good thing it's a drugstore tutorial. <laughs> Cosmo Trio in Copper Mars and I'm going to use the like bronzy shade right here. I'm just going to put that all over that base we just put on. I do really like these um, color tattoos but I feel like I have to use them as a base with like eyeshadow on top if not they will kind of crease. So next I'm going to take the darker shade, so this one here, and I'm just going to put it very close to my lash line. I'm going to kind of wing it out right till the end of the tape as well. So basically my camera just died, so um, I just finished my other eye while I was charging it. So now I will show you guys what I did. So for eyeliner, I'm going to use this Intuit... Um, felt tip pen. It's one like this, so it has kind of like a beveled tip. So like this one, I really like this one when I'm doing like a wing. I just find it so much easier to put it on the angle and go ahead and do it. Line. Way too 
just the one over at the table just to see how it turned out. I think it turned out okay. I'm just gonna join that a little bit. It obviously doesn't match the other one at all, but that's as close I'm gonna get. But for the lower lash line, I'm just gonna take a little bit of that darker color right there and put it on my lower lash line. And I'm gonna use this Revlon Photo Ready Kajal Intense Eyeliner and Brightener. So it has the brightener on this side and then the eyeliner on this side, but I'm just gonna use the black eyeliner for now. absolutely no drugstore highlighter and I cannot live without highlighter. I'm going to use the highlight shade from here as a highlighter. I mean, don't judge me, I just need a highlight and I don't have any. That looks quite nice, huh? Yeah. I honestly feel like I cannot live without highlighter, so I've resorted to putting eyeshadow on my cheeks. So finally it's time for what this entire like get ready with me thing was based upon. It's this Revlon Color Burst Matte Balm and oh my gosh I love this color so much. It is in the shade Shameless something 215? I think it's just Shameless but oh my gosh it's the most beautiful deep purple shade and I am in love. I feel like I say that about everything but That's pretty much it. 